independent chick, the only thing about being an independent chick, you guys, is that it really is not a good thing. It just means that you have no one to call. You know what I mean? Like, I have no one on speed dial, no one in case of emergency. I'm just out here by myself, right? Just lonely, no one to call. If my car breaks down on the way home, I can't even call AAA because I didn't renew, you know? <laughs> How bad is that? Oh my God. And I get really scared, like I'm the scariest person in the world. I think the boogeyman is like living with me all times, you know? I am sleeping with a knife under my pillow right now for a noise I heard two weeks ago, darn it. <laughs> I'm like, am I gonna have to make a booty call just to get somebody over here to check these closets out? So I'm like, I'm scared. The boogeyman is in my closet. <laughs> But I, I used to substitute teach. I did. I used to substitute teach. Woo, yeah. Should have some more gray hairs for that one, but I don't know. I, like, I, they put a lot of pressure on the sub, okay? As a substitute teacher, I need the teachers and the parents to understand that I am not there to make a difference in your child's life. <laughs> I'm not. I'm the sub. That's the teacher's job. <laughs> We're like gypsies, we're just in and out, you know. <laughs> Could care less. <laughs> oh my God, and then like the kids, they don't have any manners. I wish you guys would teach your kids some manners, really, honestly. I mean, like I would have done more, but I was not trying to get my third strike, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> get kicked out of the school district, yeah. I socked a little kid in his chest, I did. I did, I'm from DC, you know. <clears throat> I don't have patience, but I do have instincts. I don't know. <laughs> That's how I teach my lessons, yes. <laughs> it was crazy. I was in a math class. And I know math. I actually have two degrees, science background, so I know math pretty well. I did not know this math, though. There is a difference. And um, in the math class, and the girl was so sweet. She was like, Miss Black, can you help me with this math problem? And I looked. No, I'm sorry, I can't. <laughs> No, nope, no, nope, not today. <laughs> but she got really ghetto. Oh my gosh, she like totally changed. She was like, mm, how you gonna be in a math class if you don't even know math? And she said, math. <laughs> I was like, first of all, I am not in a math class. I'm babysitting a math class. Big difference, huge difference. Secondly, um, this is my first day. You've been here eight months, but why don't you know this? <laughs> right? I'm like, maybe you should be in an English class, girl. Check out, check out. I don't